Welcome back everybody to TechPress. In this tutorial, let's take a look into how we can change the different languages into your Shopify store, online store. There's two ways that we can get it started. The very first one and the most easy is to go directly into the applications and look out for an application that can do this for you uh, totally for free. And actually there is a lot of applications that you can choose. So if we go directly into the settings, focused into apps and sales channel, go into Shopify app store. And then what I wanted to do is to look out for my keyword here and let's go for translate now into the translation and add app it's going to be appearing a lot of places for example the ai language translate we have the shopify translate and adapt and much more usually the shopify translate and adapt is like the best tool that can be helping you to auto translate two languages totally for free so this is totally optional but in my case we're going to be using this one since the, the developer is actually code and uh, originally by the actual shopify so choose the application the best suits for you hit into install application and once you have made successfully uh done the actual application what you wanted to do is to now focus into the applications to the left part as you can see here i do have the localized content that means that my store is into english so i'm gonna hit into my online store Let's go into view your online store and let's go and check it out just like a quick view. So as you can see, it says milk, boot your uh, snow boards, feature collection, home catalog, contact, stay hydrated, try out, get waxy now, collections, everything is into English. So with this application, what I wanted to do is to change everything into a new actual language. So as you can see here, I have my products here appears my collections. So uh, this is just like a few, a quick tutorial of how it's going to be looking, they translate and adapt. And here I have the country. And when I change the country, this one should actually change the title, the language of my store. So usually the application does everything by itself. But what we actually do to make this a little bit more manual and let's say easier to get started with, you can always go into your Shopify, go into settings and into the love part, you might see that you have lots of sections here. I wanted to go into languages. Inside languages, we want to let our customers uh, add the transaction um, automatically. So I'm going to hit into add a language. And let's say that I wanted to translate everything into Italian, for example. So I'm going to hit into next. And now, as you can see, you have assigned Italian to markets. We can assign Italian to an existing primary market, which in my case is this one. I'm going to hit now into done. So usually what the application is going to be taking care of is for the actual translation. So as you can see, unpublished language, Italian here, none translations added. So you can either hit into translate and adapt. I click there. We have already downloaded the application of translate and adapt. So. I'm going to hit into auto translate, translate. Usually this one is done by the tool of the Google tra translations. We just needed to wait a few seconds till the email, till the translation is now being completed. Usually largest stores may take several hours, leaving this page will now stop translations in progress. So usually all of this information is the information that appears into my actual store. So everything that appears in here is going to be translated into the new language. In this case, it would be the Italian. Remember that free translation are only available for up to two languages after that it's going to be taking care of a few dollars once you made a transaction uh, of different languages after you have received your email you can always go back in here and remember that you always have this new section of the language and you can go for italian for example and check it out it's actually working uh acquista e productori negocio di latte and there's much more information so as you can see it is a really really great application to get started by changing uh, languages this is totally for free remember like the best tools are the best one that are developed and created by shopify you don't want it to use a third party because sometimes it might be taking uh, a few commissions and all that so we wanted to just stick around with the shopify free versions so thank you so much for watching the video don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel if you want to see more great toes of how you can make some translations totally for free thank you once again guys and hopefully we can see you all into the next video